So in this final part to the interactive render lessons, I'm going to show you how you can get it going within the native Maya render view. So if you come out to the render man menu here and you go down to preferences, and under here you can see IPR render, and this is where you set where you want your interactive render session to go. So at the minute it's set to it. And if I then tick it to go to Maya render view, press save, then when I fire up an IPR, you can see that it will activate the render view and after a moment it then begins to load up and now that's running and now the great thing about this is that you can actually dock this so if I drag it here and let go now you can see that I've got my interactive render view that's docked within the Maya viewport as well so it's more of a personal preference you can either render within the viewport, you can either work within it or you can also work within the Maya render view as well. So I hope that's been useful and let's continue onwards. Mm -hmm.